Hello, hello, hello. I am, it's Vlogmas Day 12. I'm scatterbrained. Let's see if I can. I got my lamp on today. Should I turn it off? Uh, I need a little light. Um, my hair is, I think I put too much mousse on it because it's very crunchy. I've got some soup, fresh off the stove. It's from a can. It's Campbell's Beef and Vegetable with Barley and some crackers. Gonna let that cool. But I got happy mail today. Oh my god. The first package, it just it showed up like this. I, I was too dumb to read the back of it. I was like, huh, I don't have an address on it. I wonder who that's from. And then after I opened it, I saw all the information on the back. I'm, I'm not the sharpest tool in the shed. I have blonde roots. So this is from my happy mail that I got today. I got two happy mails. I haven't opened one of them. But this one is from um, Dale, who is knit knit one t2 and i'll leave her youtube channel below in fact um but she made i don't know if she made this i think she did because it's washi tape it's a little card but she made me a little card with washi tape and stickers and had a sweet little message on the inside thank you dale but look what she made me. Oh my gosh. Y'all have no idea how much I love snowmen. But after the day I've had, that just brought a smile to my face. I feel like taking it to work and just setting it on my desk. And just looking at it all day. I'm staring at it now like happy. I think I might do that. But she also sent some stitch markers and she said I could keep two and put two in a giveaway so I might put two in the Christmas slash potiversary giveaway but she made let's see little stitch markers little Christmassy ones so it could go in the Christmassy wintry themed one I'm, I'm gonna keep this one I love light bulb stuff I'm gonna keep that one I'm torn between which one of these I want to keep. Oh, they're about the same. I'll probably keep this one. That would work really well on the hat I'm knitting right now because it's size 10 needles. I'll keep that one. And I'll put this one in the giveaway. So this one and this one I'll probably put in the giveaway. Thank you, Dale. That was sweet of you, girl. I'll put it in the bag now. So, if you did not check out that episode I did the giveaway announcement on, go check that out. And I will tell you which episode it was because I forgot. I keep notes. Day 8 slash 9 is when I had two days in one. So, go check out that to enter a chance to win that prize. Aww. I'm going to keep my card and the envelope. The envelope's cute, too. It's got stickers all over it. I keep all my nitty friends cards that I get. So sweet. So sweet. Thank you, Dale. And I got a package from my friend Amber, who is the Crafty Keller on Instagram. So we met during Vlogtober. And I have a feeling I know what this is. She didn't tell me she was sending it. I didn't know. But she's like, I've never knit with an advent. If you ever want to, send me one of yours. And I would love to knit with it. And I'll knit you something. How can I pass that up? So I gave her a little thank you gift for doing that. But she knit me something. And I got to pull up. I haven't looked at it yet. I'm just now opening the bag. 
trying not to catch anything on fire because I got my candle going over here. I'm trying to get the Christmas spirit. Relax a little. Let's see. Notebook. Favorites. I think if she sent me what I sent her. Let's see. Where is it? Advent. I have patterns. And I don't know. Oh, I don't know which pattern it was. I didn't save it. Err! I'll ask her. And I'll list it below what the pattern is. Um. I could text her real quick, but let me just look under shawls. I'm on Ravelry looking at my uh, favorites. No, I didn't save it. I usually would have saved that under Advent. I don't know why, because it's more like an Advent knit. Okay, so I'll find out what the pattern was called, and I'll put it, I'll try to put it on the screen. If I don't put it on the screen, I'll put it below. Taped up. I gotta keep, keep cutting. So I sent her a Madeline Tosh. Um, a Madeline Tosh, the first advent I ever got. And it was single skein or single plies. And they were all 10 grams a piece, I think. And I had started knitting the Land of Sweets cow by Helen Stewart. I think that's what it's called. And I just wasn't loving it. So I undid it. I wound it all up. And I sent it to her. I said, make what you want. Have fun. And I did get her a gift for doing that. Give her a couple things, actually. And, um, I'm so excited. Oh, my God. There's a little, there's a little extra in here. Oh my god! Oh my god, I'm scared to open it. <laughs> okay. Where's the opening? I know how these bags work. There's always a place. Okay, I found it. Sorry for the crinkle. I'm going to pause this while I undo the crinkle. Okay. It's so squishy. I love single ply how it knits up. I just hate knitting with it. Oh, it's so pretty. Look at the blues. Oh, oh my God. Look at it. Look at it. Oh my gosh. Look at that side. Try not to catch it on fire, too. That would be devastating. Oh. And there's that one mini that was really crazy in it. I think that was day one or day 25. I think it was day 25, I think. Oh, let's see it all in its glory. Oh, it's so pretty. Amber, thank you so much for making that for me. That and that snowman has made my week. It's only Monday. I'm wearing this tomorrow. I don't care if it's going to be 80 degrees. I'm wearing it to work tomorrow. Oh, look. And I love how you kept the colors in order. Oh, I love it so much. Oh, I hate I forgot what the pattern name is. Oh, thank you so much, Amber. That is so pretty. Okay, I'm going to put this over here so I don't show any addresses but she sent me a little extra I don't know if I should open this on camera or not I don't know if it's like we'll see we'll see we'll open it we'll open it Christmas time I feel like I should wait till closer to Christmas but I need this today y'all I'm sorry these um, vlogs are getting longer I think that's knit. It's a double brimmed hat too. Oh, and it fits perfectly. It's 
Oh my gosh. It's amazing. A little something for you. For your white tree. And she put something else in here. Because I have all white ornaments on my tree this year with red garland. Amber, you're spoiling me. Oh my gosh, that's pretty. Oh, that's going to go so good on my tree. Thank you. Oh, I felt awful. Like, I didn't. I did get her a good gift, so. I feel like I got the better gift, though. <laughs> Thank you, Amber. This is amazing. Look at all the colors. This is the most colorful stuff I have. It's going to be so amazing to wear with a black outfit to work. It's so exciting. <sighs> okay. I love it. Thank y'all. Thank you, Dale, for the snowman and the stitch markers. And thank you, Amber, for the hat and the, and the scarf and the snowflake for my tree. Y'all are amazing. Thank y'all so much. I meet the coolest people on YouTube and Instagram. I really do. If y'all are new to the knitting community, just hold tight. You're going to meet awesome people. But I'm going to pause this and eat my soup, and then we'll come back to Advent. I had to take the hat and the wrap off because it's, like, warm. It's 59 outside. But it's hot in this room. And someone made a good point. It's probably because all the wool acting as insulation. You are probably correct. And this candle doesn't help. But oh my god. I felt so colorful and fancy. Okay. I'm going to put my soup aside. I'm kind of full. I didn't even eat the crackers. I was so excited I forgot about the crackers. Let's open Advents. My printer is acting like it's going to print, but I know it's not. Felicity Yarn Studio, day 12. Yesterday was like yellow. Today is like greeny yellow. Ooh. We're getting away from that cream. Well, no, there's still a little cream in there. Kind of. Definitely a fade. She didn't say it was a fade, but it's a fade. Very pretty. Pineapple yarn. Very much more coral and orange with a very light pink. Pretty, pretty. I don't know what I'm going to do with this. This is interesting. Uh, Dragon Horde yarn. Oh, I got my pajamas on from Pajama Day at work. I didn't even have to change when I got home. Just stay in my pajamas. I will change out of my work pajamas before I go to bed, though. I'm not wearing work pajamas to bed yet. Ooh, and I like that color. It's very light pink with a bunch of speckles right there. This is called Date to Slughorn's Christmas Party. This is year six, if I am correct. Is that Order of the Phoenix? I'm not sure. It's whichever one Slughorn is in. It was after uh, his um, godfather died. So it was the one after that. I can't remember. It might be. Order of the Phoenix, and then it's the Hallows. Deathly Hallows. I don't know. It's been a while since I've watched. I'll be honest. But it is a pretty color. Aquila, day 12. 
Ooh, blues. Pretty. I feel like making something, taking one from Lisa of Knit All the Yarn Podcast and making something really scrappy with Aquilas, like mittens or socks. The only problem is those ends you have to weave in. I don't know. Maybe use like a gray to separate each color and make each color really pop. I could do those Stephen West mittens that just came out. The painting bricks mittens. I don't know. Something to think about. Pretty twisted yarn. into this bag. Ooh, and I got a sticker. Ooh, pretty Christmas sticker. The skulls have Santa hats on. I have knitting needles like that. They have little skulls at the end. My husband got me those. Ooh, I love this color. Very fancy. Very purple pinks and Teal, I guess, turquoise. I don't know. It's very pretty. I'm going to go with the others. And my rapazoid. Uh, Hue logo. Day 12. Let y'all see first. I'm seeing blue. I want to cast this on so bad. But I don't need another blanket until I finish a blanket. So pretty. It reminds me of the beach. There is a list of name of all these, but I don't worry about it. I'm not going to... She's not going to, like, read dye these or anything, I'm sure. Very pretty. Then, Lemonade Shop. Day 12. Ooh, a little purple. I love it. Very delicate. Purple. Mm-hmm. And finally, I have teal torch knits, which go in my leggings. I did not touch my leggings today. I did not have time. I knit for like 10 minutes at lunch, and then I just started working again. I was like, whatever. This is like a green and maybe we're getting into blues. It's kind of got little blues going through it. Maybe blue is the next color. Y'all, this is the 12th. We're halfway through. You hear my daughter laughing? She's so cute. I love her laugh. Okay, so that's all the advents. Let's hold them all up. Pretty. Look at the variety of color I get to see every day. You get to see it too. We get to experience this together. So pretty. Oh, I gotta use the teal torch knits. Put that back in. Oh, is this a teal torch knit? That is, right? Yeah. That way I keep them in order. Pretty. Now let's do... David's tea. We might have tea time. This might be another long one, but it's fine. Day 12. Found it. I actually can't smell it over my sugar cookie candle, so that's good. Okay. Day 12. Ooh, that looks messy. Oh my god. Okay, if you know me, you know I love unicorns. The name of this one alone sold me. Unicorn Dreams. Let's smell it. It better smell like cotton candy or something. Watch it be like the worst one. It's probably what's stinking up the whole box. There's like a little gold pellet in it. It looks like a popcorn kernel. It's probably sugar. 
I can't describe the smell. It just smells like tea. Sugary tea. We're going to try it. I'll try it after I... I'll eat a few more bites of soup and then we'll have tea time. Yeah, that's a good plan. Let's do that. Tea time is so pretty. I'll have to put a picture on the screen of what all was in it. It was like little pink hearts and a rosebud. So pretty. But I already put a little bit of honey in the bottom of my uh, cup because it just it didn't smell sweet enough so I hope I didn't make too much for my cup it's not going down where is it there it goes okay smells lovely I just love that it's called unicorn dreams I'll have to see what all is in it mmm that is quite good it just tastes like a regular tea and I think the honey helped it I'll get a little kick, but it's got a little sugary taste in it, so that's good. Let's see what's in it. David's Tea Unicorn Dreams. You sold me at the name, David's Tea. Caffeine-free fruit infusion. Okay. Get off my screen. I'm in... The United States. Okay, just no, not lost the page. Okay, caffeine-free fruit infusion is filled with smile-inducing ingredients from blue butterfly pea, yellow everlasting flower, pretty pink hibiscus blossoms. So it wasn't a rose blossom. To unicorn and heart-shaped sprinkles. Oh, it's herbal tea, tart and lightly citrusy, which is fine. It's not too bad. Dreamy notes of sweet cotton candy and creamy marshmallows. That is quite delightful. If you like a regular tea taste and not too fruity, it is very good. And I put a little bit of honey in it, so that helped. I got really dark all of a sudden. Maybe I need to put my screen back up on YouTube. There. I don't know. Well, today was a better day. I will say that. The P.O. box situation is handled. I got my P.O. box back. If I don't start making bags in January, I think I'm just going to cancel it. And I'm going to cancel my website. But I want to start making bags again. Because that little extra income really does help. Oh, there's a light. Hello, light. You're back. And then work was okay today. I got a lot done. Like, a lot. I had a meeting. And then I just... After the meeting, I was like, okay, crunch time. Got to get this done. Because stuff's got to get done. Nobody else is going to do it. I have to do it. And then I came home and joined you all for a little chat. So, overall, it's been a great day. I noticed I got a few more uh, subscribers, some new friends here, so welcome. I hope you all feel welcomed, and this is a space where we can all talk and talk about nitty things or whatever. 
I'm an open book. That tea is really good. I want to pull out one of the flowers for you to see. Ooh, it's hot. Yeah, I put boiling water in it. It should be hot. Isn't that pretty? It's so pretty. Everything's pretty. Tomorrow is Crazy Sock Day, or Festive Sock Day. They said Crazy Sock Day, but how crazy can festive socks be? So I'm going to wear my new... I wore my... Let me see if I can get my foot up this high. I wore my socks from a year or two ago today mustache yarn what's that red on the side is that my toe bleed no I think the red bled something red on it but um I'm surprised I could get my leg up that high but that's mustache yarn I can't remember the name of it. Prairie Candy Cane or something. I don't know. And I got many to go with it. And Lisa knit me these. I knit all the yarn podcast. And I wore my pajamas. And tomorrow I'm going to wear my new Christmas socks with rolled up jeans. Should probably shave my legs. I'll take that into consideration when I shower tonight. Maybe. Um, but that's it. That's all for today. This is long enough. I'm sorry these vlogs keep getting longer and longer and longer. I just ramble. I'm sorry. So, I hope you have a great night. A great day. Whatever time you're watching this. And I will see you tomorrow for vlog. Vlogmas Day 13. Bye.